Hey guys, what's good? And today I'll be continuing from where I left off from the first part of the video that I've made yesterday. Today it will be, you know, going through other base and yeah, I'm gonna show you how. So as you guys can see, um, right, like, let me see. Okay, you guys can see that I have 524,940 gold, 120 tickets, 942 medals. Some of you guys may think I am using some kind of hack, but no, I do not use hack. Um, I earn these medals purely from playing. I didn't pay money, I didn't do anything. So I got it very plain simple. Just play. First video I have made short cake, waffle, cream puff, and cake roll. So now I'm gonna be making Yulok, which is the rare one. I have made this video of making Yulok past four years ago. So, but I'm gonna do it again. A couple of other things. Um, I will try to wait a minute. Okay, change of plan. <clears throat> I will not make you lock but instead I'm gonna make whatever I can make other than the ones that I've made yesterday so as you can see I have quite a bit of money and I can buy quite a bit of stuff so I'm just gonna buy two of each okay roll set Right, so I bought two of two of each. <coughs> Excuse me. I haven't checked what other ingredients I have, so I'm just gonna make straight off the plate. This is a medium size, four topping, same as others. You know, don't use this. Use this if you have it. If you don't have it, use this or this. Doesn't matter. I use this. Um, what can I make with this? Um, let me see. I'm not sure if you, if I have shown you guys how to make donut, but I believe I did in the past video. And I will see what do I have to make. You know what? Let's skip. No, let's not skip. Okay, let's jump straight. Cake roll. Okay, since I have a cake roll, why not make a U-Log? So first you need a U-Log um cake roll. And you will need um chocolate chocolate cream. So actually any chocolate works, you know. You can add this. I'll just add chocolate drizzle. And I will add the straw. And lastly, I will add cream. Voila, I have a U-Log. So, after that, once you make this, it doesn't really matter what you add, but you know, since for the sake of the looks, I'll just add this. Now, I did mention in the past that Ulox is one of the rare recipes and this somehow like it makes, you know, any contest that you go, you can beat a lot of contests using this recipe, but don't just use them too often because it's the originality score is going to go down, so it's not really effective unless you're going to go for third tier or fourth tier challenge then you might want to use this rank c well there are players out there who can get rank a and b you know it really depends it, because their ingredients their level is very high they use their metals to upgrade their ingredients or so wow i got a premium dk or if not they you know they have used other things so i have made a u log so what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna um send 
let's see give set fixture oh, I go for a fixture right let's create something else same as this I will now try to make a donut because I want to make a bamu kuchen but I don't have donut in my the list so pretty simple sponge cake extract you know it doesn't really matter which extract you use you know, both both t both are terrible so I use the extract and then finally I will add cream I've made a donut so I have two toppings left um, at this Right, so I have made a donut. Well, I'm gonna be selling this until the the shop they can process it long enough, probably a few months. I mean, in the game time, few months, which is like 30 minutes or maybe one hour, two hours. You're gonna be able to see a donut in the in the pumpkin product shop. But right now, I don't see it. So as of now, I will create. Let me just sell some stuff that is terrible. Um, I will sell no, I will sell this and I will sell this. Right, so I will show you guys how to make a chocolate cake. Pretty much, even if I don't show you guys, you guys be able to find out. Like, it is one of the most basic one. You know, it's try and error. So I will add. You have to have a base as um the sponge cake and three chocolate. So. Doesn't matter which chocolate you use, so I will see what is the best option. I will just use this. Use this. Alright, my bad. Actually, I was able to make it with two goals. So, I have two more um, options left. So, what I'm gonna do is, you know, how a shop will make the cake look like you know guys I mean when you're watching this and if you find that you know you have a better ones like when you see it and you say like hey I can make this better please do write down in the comment I really want to know you know I'm not really good at getting a combo so I will just probably get this Alright, so I did not realize I don't think I have pudding, so I'm gonna make a pudding. This is the this is the final one that I'm gonna be making for this video. Um, 
I'm gonna be using jelly, sugar, maple syrup, whichever works fine. Just use. I will just use um, sugar, which is. Let me see where it is this one and then I will end off with cream Honestly, I have no idea what I'm doing as for this combo thingy. I'm just adding whatever I see. Usually, I use this guy, slice on this guy for texture up. That's it. I don't use anyone else. Right. So, next video, I'll be covering... I hope to cover some rare recipes like tart, Cairo Ima Yokan, but I gotta have chestnut. If those of you guys have chestnut, the recipe is big pudding, chestnut, chestnut cream, yam cream, and sugar. But you need to find a big plate. In order to do so, you have to get, um, you have to create more, and then you have to get a new supplier. So what I mean by that is, right now I'm at supplier number three. You wanna get a big plate? You gotta get up to supply four or five. If I'm, if I'm not wrong. So you have to play until then. So some of you may ask why is my metal on top so much? I have like 945 of them. Reason is because I played this game about 10 hours straight and then I just leave it on. I just let it run, you can collect the metals. But it's very important that you train your staff all the time because if they are slow, you're not gonna get on the metals easily. So for this, you see, I'm paying this guy 800 gold, but my prep speed and speed is about 200 both. So it's not a bad deal unless you want to hire more stuff. You're going to pay like 10,000 gold for speed at 180, prep 140. I don't see it's worth it. I'd rather pay 800 gold for this. So yeah, that's it for today's video. Stay tuned for the next one. I'll be trying to make those recipes that I have failed to make in the past. Which is only one actually, but I gotta get a chestnut that coin. And remember to continue to do a promotion because if you don't do this, you're not gonna be able to get a new ingredients such as like chestnut, chestnut cream. You're not gonna be able to get it. Those things are only attainable by certain customer base, which is you know some folks that comes around, they'll be able to give it to you. So. If you have any more interesting recipe or anything, and if you don't believe that my U-Log is powerful enough to beat those contests, well, this is to prove you wrong. And if in a case where you lose, then maybe you did not, I don't know, play enough. I mean, you you, you maybe used U-Log for contest number five, like level five, level six, which is very high, then you will not be able to win at all. But in fact, I'm pretty confident I win this. So the winner is... Well, originality is very little, but still I won by a huge margin. So it's okay. Okay, so one of the ways to earn money is by getting into contest frequently and earning gold. And always send trucks like really just send them out i prefer to send you know the one with the high price tag and i will just send them All right this is it for this video if you like the video um please give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel um, yeah, it really helps to motivate me to create more content. 
and I know my channel name is silent but you know I can't be silent for this game particularly yeah so thanks for watching and stay tuned for the next video